taking the lead. No go three. Friendly UAV on station. Advised, enemy personal radar enemy active. At the
These names are freaking awful. How the fuck do you how do you expect people to pronounce this shit? I mean, seriously. C T Hulu who? <laughs> That's what it is. It's C T Hulu who. I mean, it's a mix of Counter Strike and fucking Hulu, dude. Lick hard. Yeah, oh, you're gonna love this one. Lick yard. <sighs> Wow, dude. that's the most fucked up fucking spawn I've ever had on somebody. Look at your bunny hopping bitch ass, dude. Get out of here. Uh, three corner campers open up on one spot, and the kid had thermal on. Oh my god. On a fucking LMG! <laughs> what a fucking trash game. Get me off this fucking game. I'm done with this shit. I don't even want to look at that. Goodbye. Catch you guys later. I'm done. I'm not fucking playing this goddamn game. <laughs> Fuck that. I'd rather go play fucking Battlefield 1. And that's exactly what the fuck I'm gonna do. Oh my god, another corner camp and faggot. Oh nice I know he just switched walls, dude. Oh my god. Look at this kid, he's gonna come to this wall. No! Oh, I'm losing my mind, Cody. You don't wanna buy this game, dude. Don't give him the money. Don't give him the money, they don't deserve it. Look at this kid, look at this kid camping in the corner. Alright, I just had to throw in this clip from the campaign, guys. I had to put this in this video and throw a commentary over it. So many people are saying this part from the campaign. Oh, well, they're just trying to, trying to make war look realistic. Oh, bitch, please. The only reason they put this shit in the campaign was simply to get a response from people. And they are sure as hell going to get one from me. And I don't care if kids are in the campaign killing some freaky Russians who murder people, okay? I don't have a problem with that at all, even though other people do. But where is the logic in this? You have a 300, 325 pound Russian, a 325 pound Russian, a trained 325 pound Russian who looks like he could toss a, 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 a Prius or some small car about 30 feet with only one arm maybe even three fingers I mean look at the size of this motherfucker and you're gonna tell me he, he's going up against a tag team of kids who are seven and eight years old and they're going up against a 325 pound Russian who is on roids. Who the hell came up with this shit? I mean, I'll admit, I did not see this part coming, you know, where the seven year old girl gets to shove an AK 47 up a Russian's ass and unloads the clip. But still, this was the most ridiculous part of the campaign. All I've got to say is at least walking into an airport with guns was realistic on Modern Warfare 2. For instance, we have people that walk into shopping malls and movie theaters with guns in real life, but a seven-year-old girl and an eight-year-old against a giant of a human being that's from Mother Russia and the kids end up winning? Come on, man. You, you, you're telling me you couldn't think of a better way to jumpstart this campaign Oh, I, I, I'm done. I liked the Special Forces feel from the other missions from the campaign, but this was ridiculous. Just like this fucking game, man. There is nothing special about this game. In fact, this is one of the worst games I have ever played. All the way around. I have never seen a game punish a player so severely for moving around when it comes to the multiplayer. It's sickening. 
to see how Call of Duty is now and especially how players play it, that's even worse. It's sickening. It's sickening to see what it was before and what it is now. It's absolutely disgusting. I don't understand how you can go from making piles of pure gold with MW2 and some of the older Call of Duty games to making piles of dog shit in less than a decade with all of these crappy ass games, man. It's pathetic. I hate to come across like this, but it's the truth.